our feature presentation. Sorry. <laughs> Perfect. Yeah. So, you know, uh, a money, uh, terrible job. And, mm -hmm. um, you know, why not? <laughs> why not? Live a little. Live a little. <laughs> little, yeah. Um, cool. Very nice. Um, so, I, I'd like to start off by asking what was the f your, your first memory of seeing a movie in like the cinema? Oh my goodness, that's a great question. Uh, I think it was, no, I actually don't remember, but I do remember uh, going to a birthday party, which I think was for like my brother's friend. So I was like very little uh, and they used to give old uh, like film reel footage uh, oh. as like a birthday prize. And I had um, footage of the Little Mermaid, uh, just like a couple frames. That's so and, sweet. Yeah, that was a very early movie memory. And I don't mm. remember what we saw, but I do remember <laughs> getting that uh, reel. <laughs> very cool. That's great. Um, mm. <laughs> well, OK, so that's one of the establishing, like, get to know the person. Yeah. Oh, this is like one of your, yeah. your pre-written. Like, yeah, that was my favorite uh -huh. and um, one of my <laughs> pre-writs. And then I have like, quote unquote, trivia questions. And mm -hmm. I like to start off with the same one every time because mm -hmm. people have given me a lot of wild answers for this one. What okay. is movie? Oh, OK. Uh, a movie is uh, an image that comes to people's minds that they create together uh to bring about in reality for other people to share in mm. you like that one yeah that i like that good? it was very like uh, very, very intellectual cerebral. Yeah. <laughs> then what's cinema what's the difference between movie and cinema follow-up oh, trivia question i think cinema was just made up by like old white guys <laughs> who were like uh, we need to like differentiate ourselves from like the scum that like movies so we'll call it cinema yeah um, truly awful yeah. um i love <laughs> a movies movie. are gay <laughs> i um i love to call it a picture i love to go ah what a great picture what a great that was a great picture that's yeah. really fun one that's very like old timey yeah you're gonna be a star in the picture see yeah <laughs> um okay we so we're actually smoking uh cigars for yeah for those just <laughs> listening yeah no herbal cigarettes <laughs> if you will um so next trivia question uh -huh. which movie has the most likable villain Ooh, that's a great question uh i think this is only coming to mind because i watched it recently uh but shampoo have you seen i have a dvd copy but oh i have not God. seen it i know carrie fisher's in it baby carrie, carrie fisher's in it baby carrie fisher she's amazing uh, i mean it's just one of those where it's like you know the main guy in a way is like a scumbag but it's one of those it's like but the movie's justifiably all about him you know like, <laughs> sure, it's yeah. like this is this is a romp um it's great uh very fun like political undertones to it all yeah mm, I mean, mm -hmm. yeah okay. I will have to put in the DVD copy that I own. You will have to. It is. It's a. It's a great movie. I. Yeah. I unfortunately did find it on the side of the road here in New York City. Stop it. Someone had really? thrown it out. <gasps> Someone. Oh my God. Something had happened though in this person's life because it was uh -huh. like they had great taste because it was like they had that and then an Eddie uh -huh. Izzard special and then like I. <gasps> Then um, the master, I was like, oh, you have great, what happened? Did someone what like break up? Happens, right, yeah. break up or just like a rejected cinema, like yeah. cinema. Cinema, um, un I, film. Uh, un film. <laughs> so next, next trivia question. Mm -hmm. In right. the animated, in the Pixar animated film mm -hmm. Cars, yes. they have mouths. Do they eat? Uh, I assumed they ate gasoline, mm. uh, like, and that was their, uh, but all this also maybe gasoline is their uh, monetary system. Um, huh. I don't, I don't know. Um, I do think that these are the cars universe. Uh, I think is something that we should not look away from. We should keep digging and inspecting until we uh, fully understand the implications of the universe. I think so too. I've mm -hmm. done a quick Google search image for Lightning McQueen Kachow. And <laughs> yeah. 
and I'm not seeing like a gas tank, you know, like on the side. No so you hole. may well be right. You may have. How many first... holes does a car have in the <laughs> universe car? I don't know how many holes, mm. but I know that mm. I want to plug some. Now, anyway. What you? Watch out! <laughs> um next question um trivia question now there is a right and a wrong with it because again okay. it's trivia yeah. i cannot i assume i'm winning thing. i like I'm just, okay okay yeah you're doing quite I got, well i got a nod okay <laughs> who mm -hmm. out of all the lord of the rings characters mm -hmm. has the best hair oh my god aragorn i know <laughs> legolas is like the go-to uh -huh. yada yada and when i was a young gal oh my god mm -hmm. that movie was it came out right when i was 13 right when hormones were <laughs> hitting me for the very first time and like almost every character i was like <gasps> uh, <laughs> family. uh you know very kind guy yeah he was attracted to nice guys <laughs> um uh, but really aragorn was uh, you know no on another level follow-up mm -hmm. question yeah <laughs> is the hair better when he like has like gets a blowout at the end of return of the king or is that worse oh Ooh, that's a great question i do kind of like the rugged like you know mm -hmm. he just came off of the field kind of look um <laughs> i but i do appreciate a blowout yeah yeah for sure uh -huh. um it's like they managed to find a fucking comb for like five seconds yes yes uh, it is when he's like turn coming into his kingness i guess mm. and so i was like dude can you please like brush it <laughs> please you need to look presentable please. if you're gonna get married Ugh. yeah my head cannon is legolas is like you know doing my 100 <laughs> brushes and they're like having a little sleepover girl time. Oh, yeah. that mm. sounds great that sounds actually very good <laughs> where's uh, that scene where's that in the deleted scene <laughs> I saw the extended version. I didn't see that. Mm. Uh. 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 Now, what Star Wars character uh -huh. do you want them to never make a Disney Plus series about? Oh, wow. Yeah, you would be that's like, I hate this. Question. That is a great question. I, that's kind of hard to answer because I feel like I'm in the like masochist, like, yeah, do it. Like any <laughs> side character that's been in that, I'm like, canon canon give him a series i don't you know like I, it's almost like a dare at this point um sure. of like no do it um so it's really hard to come up with one that i would detest but i guess probably and this might be controversial but like padme like hmm. queen amadala like i i, I, I don't want it i would rather have you know like a different handmaiden you know or mm -hmm. like someone else in the universe I just feel like they they bungle her so often that it's like I don't want to see them do worse. <laughs> That's fair. Yes, I can understand that. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. I mean, there's not knowing that she dies from a broken heart. It's really just we know how this ends. Yeah. Ah, it feels yeah, like good, dragging good. a dead cat out the door. <laughs> <laughs> now, mm -hmm. how many slaps in the face would it would you take to be mm -hmm. the star of an A twenty four film? Oh my, uh, 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 endless. I mean, I guess until it would be like structural damage to, uh, you know, to, to the money maker. Uh, yeah, sure. For <laughs> sure. I stop resembling uh, my father in, in facial structure is when I need them to stop because okay. that's near and dear to my heart. <laughs> Understood. But you would, up until disfigurement, up until you would. Then, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. Fair okay. game. Fair game uh i give my body to art <laughs> <laughs> i give my body to art you heard it here folks oh my gosh uh, <laughs> um who was your first character crush oh that's a great question oh many mm -hmm. um but i do have a very formative uh evening Actually, it was a, a day. I had a sleepover at my friend's house, and she had a huge basement. Her mom was a judge, uh, so, you know, she had, like, money. Yeah. yeah. They had a huge, like, uh, TV in their basement, and we woke up from a sleepover, and we didn't want to do anything that day. So I was like, you know what? We're going to have a Reese Witherspoon film festival. And we watched, uh, <laughs> we watched so Sweet Home Alabama. We watched Legally Blonde. And we watched... Um, uh, 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 I'll walk the line. Yeah. Um, yes. <laughs> you know, yes. Fell in love with all of them, but walk the line really stayed with me for a very long time. Both her is June Carter and of course, obviously Johnny Cash. Um, yeah. so yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. 
So I'm I'm gonna preamble this one. This one's a little horny. Okay. So I mean, as so far we've <laughs> we've been scooting diary. around yeah, being horny. Yeah. <laughs> um, which movie monster would you do you want to fuck? That's the thing. Ooh. Do you uh, want to? actively the creature in the black lagoon uh <laughs> like Perfect. actively uh we have a like an old vhs 3d copy of creature in the black lagoon with the old it comes with like the 3d glasses you know the like red and blue um we watched it uh, a couple summers ago on a projection and i was just like yeah <laughs> Perfect. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. It came um, alive. <laughs> it did. Uh, it did. It truly anyway. did. Um. That's very. That sounds like a very fun evening. Yes. <laughs> um. I think. Finally, mm-hmm. we might be finally through, and this is mm-hmm. again the one I end with every time. Great. Why is Austin Powers so sexy? This is actually a great question. Um, and first, anyone curious about this uh, should read an article written by my friend, uh, Dave Schilling uh, for Polygon, uh, which does address this very question. What is it about Austin Powers and his mystique? And I will put forth uh, my theory in that uh, he's actually like a feminist character <laughs> in that mm-hmm, mm-hmm. he generally like respects women. Uh, which is something that, you know, the 70s was not known for and did not do well at, yes. uh, by and large. So it is really fun to see a more modern character, uh, you know, take a look back at that time. It's like, yeah, baby, but like women's rights. <laughs> and like, in a way, it is like very hilarious and how easy it could have been, <laughs> should have been. Yeah, it could have been yeah. very clearly that like they could have messed it up so bad i feel like also like Mm -hmm. you saying that kind of i think that's one of the reasons it's also like kind of funny because james bond is so the opposite you know so it's like oh yeah that actually makes sense yeah all right yeah go ahead oh no i was gonna say it's funny when there are men that clearly love women that and I actually hate them though you know yeah. they're really mean they just like hate women obviously but there are guys that love women and it's very clear that they just love women it's like you yeah. could just do that <laughs> you could just do that you could just you have could a just good time do... yeah yeah oh gosh uh, man anyways I digress if, if we could only fix everyone <laughs> <laughs> slap, slap, so, slap 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 you're in a movie um mm-hmm. so Let's get to the meat and the okay. potatoes, shall we? Mm-hmm. Of oh, the, my Irish the heritage, you're calling me back. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I recently got diagnosed with celiac disease and I was like, well, thank God I already was a meat and potatoes gal. I'm so <laughs> fine. But I, I am upset at the English chronically for me now having to mm-hmm. shop in a special section. Anyway. Uh, uh, guys. <laughs> so the random word... Mm-hmm. for today is mm-hmm. stroke oh yeah. there's hello. a few ways this could go yes and i there's generally an obvious route but we are artists we are creatives <laughs> yes we can add layers yes um, mm-hmm. i think what would be fun mm-hmm. let me know if you like this start is mm-hmm. having it be about golf i stop we are on another level right now uh yes uh i was i was thinking of golf and also bowling because stroke is very close to strike Mm -hmm. but stroke uh is of course as we all know something that happens in the game of golf yeah uh and i would like to purport i think uh, the golf is um more the uh you know the overarching uh story like yes it's a golf game yes it's it's a tournament probably takes place in the 1930s um because Mm -hmm. they had great outfits back then they truly Um, did they truly did i think maybe it is also a a romance that that Mm -hmm. happens on on the golf course what what do you think about about this i like that can Mm -hmm. love bloom on the golf on the links (laughs) wow and love bloom on the links and love bloom on the links yes mm. i like that um mm-hmm. 
Okay, I think so. It's got to be like 1930s. It may mm -hmm. does. It's giving Agatha Christie. It really is. Yes. Oh, is there a murder? There, <gasps> I feel like there could be a murder, and there are two yes. ladies that fall in love. How do we feel yes. about that? I okay. love it. Are they golfers themselves, or do they work at the golf course? Oh, I think one of, be golfers. one of them's <gasps> oh, rich, and one of yes. them's not. Yes, this is beautiful. <laughs> what are the works on the golf course? Mm -hmm. They're like the girl. I was gonna say gardener, but I don't know if they would let women be gardener. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, I don't know if they would let her do that. What? Um, what if she's a groundskeeper, but she's pretending to be a boy to be a groundskeeper? Oh, this is beautiful. Yeah. She is poor, so she dresses as a boy <gasps> to gain a uh, to gain work at the local golf mm -hmm. course, and of course she's a actually girl so she likes being near high society you know mm -hmm. she's still enraptured in the american dream of oh if i just learn hard enough like, <laughs> i'll make it home perfect uh, which is crushed by the end obviously but you know we got to start out with you know character so she's character arc um and now i've heard that before and i don't like mm -hmm. it i'm i'm a person that likes certain kinds of movies with no mm -hmm. character no development. character arc I actually, I am with you on that in a lot of cases. I think a lot of people when they, oh, it seems to be a lot of times screenwriters are just saying that there like needs to be a character arc because they like something else is lacking in their script yeah. that they can't pinpoint and they want to like put it on the actor. <laughs> so it's sure. like, oh, well, it's actually not interesting because like actually like the, isn't the, like the actor's not doing enough and it's like, mm, no. Also, really too, don't change. <laughs> what if they don't change and it gets worse for them? How about As, the changes that is yes. worse by the end of the film? Yes, I. Oh, we are getting to like a philosophical um, <laughs> layer to film. So, anyways, yeah, yeah. Uh, I think it gets worse in that. Um, I think she does not, you know, ascend her uh, mm. poor status. Um, no. I mean, maybe they run away together. I'm not opposed to a happy love ending. Mm -hmm. That's. I, I think that's uh, my, the temptation is, of course, to make it like, you know, if it's gay, it can't end happy. Clearly, right, so like I want right. to, but my first mm -hmm. like notion is like, what if <laughs> she obviously the woman falls in love with our girl dressed up as a guy as a guy, mm -hmm. you know, and then she finds out she's a woman and she's like, okay with that. But then she's like, mm -hmm. oh, you're poor, ew. <laughs> Then, like... <laughs> okay. Oh, I love that. Okay, because our let's talk. Let's talk about our, our mean girl, um, girl for a moment. Okay. Our, our our rich girl. Mm -hmm. Um, so she is probably a golfer because you know if you're affluent, you're able to you know um, what's her name? Then a girl who's not Daisy in uh Great Gatsby. Mm -hmm. She's like all for, you know, and it's like, yeah. if you're rich, they kind of just let women do whatever. Cause it was cute. Mm -hmm. Um, <laughs> you know, like, yeah. cute, she's a golfer. so mm -hmm. she, you know, she's a high society. She is a golfer. Maybe she's entering this tournament as a fun, like, uh, you know, pu publicity stunt. She's mm -hmm. a woman in the tournament. <gasps> Her dad is also rich and has done some bad business dealing. And so <gasps> she's like, we have to focus on me. Yes. So people whoosh, don't know. Yes. yes. And she's becoming like a society person. You know, Ooh. she's like, mm -hmm. has a name and she's making a name for the family. Um, and she's like, oh, this is a good distracting from, you know, the family businesses. Um, mm -hmm. So she signs up to you know beat all the boys in her mind um you know there obviously there's a lot of press there which makes their illicit romance you know even mm. more fun <laughs> yes even more illicit if you can believe uh, <laughs> illiciter one might say Eliciter, yes <laughs> um may i offer up casting mm -hmm. ideas for our two leading ladies please yes what about yes. elizabeth debicki and mm -hmm. then also kiki lang Yes, who and who? Kiki Lang as I would say Porter. gardener girl. Yes. Personally. Yes. Because then yes. also you think like, oh, maybe, you know, there's tension because like she's racist. And then it's like, no, she just hates poor people. Yes. That's actually too yes. Yeah. Because I mean that's and I'm sure there will be many people that are <laughs> racist on the field. For sure. Um oh, I like that. Okay. uh what is their meet cute i wonder how do they meet what is the introduction into this world hmm. of these two women hmm. I, 
I feel like the obvious thing is like she's trimming a hedge and then the golf ball goes wild and she has to go near it, right? That's yeah. Yeah. Or mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> or how's this? She gets into a water trap and makes Kiki Lang like go <gasps> into the water to and get then the ball. <laughs> to get the ball. And then she notices right away that she's a lady, but no one else does because they're stupid. <gasps> That's beautiful. That's beautiful. Oh, and is there some sort of like, you know, they start like, te like mean spirited, like teasing each other, but then it turns into like, oh, they're both in the water and they're like, yeah. Each other. This is like this is like way too far into fanfic. Yeah, but... I was like, we're we're veering low. I like it though as a concept though. Yeah, yeah. Something like that. If not something that light hearted thing. like that, yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Or she just, you know, splashes her from the mm -hmm. the water. Um, and so then of course they have to go dry off. Mm -hmm. And they're talking about how they both got into a man's world. <laughs> uh. Perfect. Love it. Uh, mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, so w we have the meetup. Then mm -hmm. I mean, like, what's the muddle? What is like? What's the? I guess the second yeah. act. The is murder. Yeah, was, the, yeah. Oh, right, the murder. I completely yeah. forgot. Who gets murdered and Who why? Murdered. What's the murder? Hmm. It could be another player. Could be her father. Could be her father. If we want to make it familial. Mm -hmm. Um, it could be another coworker. Could be the owner of the <gasps> the person tournament. putting on the tour yeah the person putting on the tournament oh, mm -hmm. so it's a very like big scandal yes a huge scandal the newspapers would be going even more wild once they find <sighs> out that someone does does her dad is the, her dad the murderer to like <gasps> further like oh maybe he the the person who puts on the uh puts on the tournament is like involved in the business conspiracy and like it's gonna come to light that he was like involved in it mm -hmm. and so they need to or he was gonna like expose it you know, yeah something. he's going out he's gonna mm -hmm. give a, a go to the police mm -hmm. i think is this related to the mob do we think Ooh. I hadn't thought of that, but yes, what do you I think? I just feel like they're an easy scapegoat. <laughs> <laughs> mom, yeah. A lot of people were working with them and, and for them. Yes. Uh, oh, the mob. That, I thought you know. said the mom. Like, oh, the, oh. like her mother is like, what? <laughs> but yeah, some sort of work. I think maybe just yeah. to add a little spice, the Yakuza. Oh, wow. This makes it international. <laughs> for sure. I mean, for sure. You want to play to as many markets as possible. Um, <laughs> yes. So, you know. If we could actually have some scenes set uh, in China or Japan, that would be fantastic. Yeah, it'd I don't be know. make the whole thing easier to sell uh, <laughs> yes. abroad. Yes. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, I like that. Mm -hmm. um, so he's trying to cover it. So he's going to go to the police, and then he has to be hushed up. But then that's yeah. more. More scandal. More scandal. Yes. And then... mm. Ooh, it could also have gone like maybe like someone was just there to like threat you know kind of threaten him and be like this could happen and then it kind of just like goes wrong and, mm -hmm. and ends up being an accidental kill so actually maybe the father doesn't even really know who i mean i guess he knows who did it but like you know not on purpose go yeah. this far <laughs> yeah and now he's like oh no i'm gonna go to jail because someone accidentally killed some guy right oh, right i love an accidental death yeah i yeah I watched mm. Lost Highway for the first time like last <gasps> month and that Ooh. accidental death, I'm like, oh damn, okay. Yeah. I love when that happens because I mean, it does happen. You know, even a lot mm -hmm. of like murders are kind of like, I'm a very like accident prone person. So would any- So you've committed a murder? So I've committed uh, several murders <laughs> um, and it's all just like, oopsies. <laughs> Italia, oopsies. <laughs> oh, oh my gosh. Okay, so I like the murder. Because uh, I, I feel like what's so fun about that is like you think the first act is like, okay, we have a rom-com here and then a murder right. happens and it's got to be gross. It's got to be like a gross murder, yes. right? And also because it's an accident, it's like, oh, we, we got to make it uh, look like a, a, a murder. So they do a lot of fake clues kind of things, you know, like <laughs> they light some candles, they make a little like pentagram, you know, kind of like an axe murder okay. kind of thing going on. Um, and so when we first find the details, it's very like, oh no, it must be be the gardener <laughs> oh that's so good here. um oh. but no nah, she's oh. just an innocent gal 
I like that a lot. So then, yeah. then Elizabeth Debicki has to be like, okay, I have to choose this new love of my life or mm -hmm. my dad. That's yeah. very good. Ooh. Or daddy, 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 <laughs> whom, whom I love. <laughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Who does she choose, do you think? Do they try to run off together? This is the question. This I feel the like question. our, our uh, the middle of the film, there actually is no scientific way to refer to it. The middle of the film is, <laughs> is what it's called. Um, the where you aspiring screenwriter the clump. <laughs> yeah uh the bathroom break um, <laughs> um. that's quite good actually <laughs> that's the only like denotion of act structure is when you you right take beginning a piss. bathroom break <laughs> ending um what are they they're trying to solve the murder because if they can solve it they can uh both you know uh, what, you know, the uh, Elizabeth Trebecki thinks that she can, um, you know, clear her family's name. Mm -hmm. uh, they think they can clear her, her new love's name and they're going to run off into the distance. Um, but then uh, what if that, you know, doesn't, what if they can't? Or what, what if that's when she finds out that it's actually her father who's involved? So oh. they can't go against him. So, <laughs> but what if mm -hmm. this? Mm -hmm. Yes. Then they like thoroughbreds his ass and then kill him. <gasps> oh, oh is that, this this movie has everything. <laughs> so this is oh, I love it. It's uh, it's giving to me um, what is it? Uh, where they dry off the cliff. Oh, uh, uh, yeah, film and Luis. Yeah, yeah, you know, yeah, yeah. like uh, let me kind of like a pact to the devil, and yeah, if they figure out that he's behind it, then it's like if we kill him and recreate the weird like <gasps> pentagram whatever mm -hmm. that it'll look like some person is just making their way through high society mm -hmm. uh well so you know maybe actually justifiable <laughs> is uh <laughs> you know maybe not the right way to go about things mm -hmm. um maybe not the best judge um yeah okay do I they like run it. away together do they suicide mm. pact do they do they Both join the Yakuza? Do they join? Do they join I mean, the business? Although hmm. they killed their father, they were probably on the run. The people, the business is probably trying to kill them too. Yeah, yeah. that's got to be it. Yeah. It's like, like a, the police and the Yakuza after yes. them. Yes, both after them. Is the French mob the Yakuza? Is that anything? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god up, up, i've never up, up, really up. considered the french having a mob but of course they did <laughs> of course. like every every country's got their thing right they they all have to have some sort of organized right. crime so otherwise so how do a leader get culture. elected yeah <laughs> yeah how's a leader get elected okay i like the idea mm -hmm. of them i like the idea of them running away together to be yes. honest and... We could also do, and I'm throwing this up, this is like mm -hmm. a big leap of faith. And honestly, I don't really like it when movies do this in general. But what if they run away together, both disguised as men, maybe just for the fun of it. Mm -hmm. And what if they get away with it for like a couple of years? They have like a cottage in the woods and they think that mm. they're in the clear, but then their past comes to catch up with them after, you know, years of living together. I usually don't like time skips, but I'm putting it out there. I don't know. I, I like it. I think it's good. I think them mm -hmm. like going to like the South of France and like having an idyllic <gasps> lifestyle Ooh. and then all of a sudden mm -hmm. people are like, you know, they're, it, you know, Skyfall ass, like mm -hmm. now we yeah. have to get out of this. Uh, right. How are we doing this in our cabin in the woods? Right. Ooh. I mean, and they... it can also be like a, twofold of like the town is starting to realize that they're not men so it is both Ooh. a revealing of their gender and their uh past crimes of a killing spree um coming back to haunt them uh, mm. and the jacuza is like you must you must we get out you. of here <laughs> yeah yeah uh, but then do, do mm -hmm. we keep ending up at the same point and is it mm -hmm. do they die in the end this is a great question. Do they I die? really don't know what way to go. Um, I'm conflicted, right? I'm conflicted because, like, the most dramatic would obviously be that they, you know, die in each other's arms or whatever. It's like they're blah, blah, almost going to get away, but they don't exactly. Yeah. But so then that makes me want them to get away. But then that does that end up being an unsatisfying 
mm. you know, idealized cliche of, oh, they got away. So story over or is that satisfying mm. enough? Mm. Or, or does one get away and one not? Oh, how about this? I feel mm -hmm. like the we open it up to a sequel because the French, the Jacuzza do come around. Yes. Of and course. they're like, we know who you are. Baguette! You know done. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's oh. Jean Reno. Jean oh. Reno shows up and he's like, we know yeah. who you are. But mm -hmm. also, we need someone to do this job. And then it's like, uh, bum, bum, bum. <gasps> bum, bum, bum. Oh my God. And then they become like, yeah. like spies together because we already know that they can get away with it. Precisely. Uh, yeah. Oh, oh, we did beautiful. it. Beautiful. Then we can pitch it uh, as a, um, you know, a. What do you call it? A trilogy? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like a <laughs> cinematic universe. Yeah, 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 yeah. The cinematic universe. <laughs> Perfect. Love it. Um, mm -hmm. Do we want it just to be called Stroke or do we have a different name? Man, Stroke is fucking. It's bleak. It, it's, 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 it's bleak, but it's on the nose, which I love. I uh -huh. love single syllable names mm. uh, for movies, especially. It's just like really, you know, in Good. your face. Um, anything that reminds me of Flash Gordon, which stroke does <laughs> I an exclamation point yeah 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 yeah. perfect stroke. great all right <laughs> i'm now realizing that apparently there's some sort of timer on the zoom meeting and we have three minutes so i might have to send you a new one or That's we might have to wrap fine. up in three minutes i mean either way i do have to do a charity stream after this oh gross um, okay you're a good person i'm yeah and i definitely <laughs> didn't kill a bunch of people like i said earlier so <laughs> Okay, then we'll only do a couple of the, the lightning <laughs> rounds. But before we do, just so everyone knows who you are, what you do, where can people find you? Oh, good golly gosh. Uh, man, you can find me on Twitter, unfortunately, uh, at Maggie Mayfish. <laughs> I really try to not be on it. I don't like attention uh, and I like it less and less like the older I get, I know, <laughs> which just feels very counterintuitive um, to my choice of uh, work. Fair. Uh, but find me there. I I'm joking around. Uh, I yik yak. Um, and then <laughs> I'm also... So <laughs> yik yak. Uh, uh, <laughs> it back. Uh, uh, I don't talk back on YouTube at all. So uh -huh. if you want a one-way mirror of me talking at you, um, find me on YouTube. Um, and that's also just my name. And it's Maggie May with an uh, M-A-E, e. not M-A-Y. All mm -hmm. my haters call me M-A-Y. And Perf. only my friends know that that's not right. <laughs> that's for friends and fans. That's for friends and fam. Yeah. <laughs> So, okay, what we, I, we got a one word here. What's latest about? What's the quick movie pitch for the word latest? Latest. Ooh, to me, that is about uh, a, like, an undercover, like, news organization that mm. is, like, not bringing in the money. They are just struggling to make ends meet. It's like an uncle and, like, two young women and, like, yeah, an old weirdo who, like, sits in the corner <laughs> And they're like, no, you know what? We are gonna band together and bring this baby up. So they start making wild fake stories um, to uh, Perfect. Sell, uh, sell newspapers. Oh, that's um, very good. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's very good. Um, for me, it's this guy who has like an overdue library book from his hometown and he has to go back and he has to, you know, deal with that emotionally. Thanks. I think we only have time for one. Mm -hmm. So that's that. Thank you so much Aww. for doing this. This was a blast and a half. This is so fun. Oh, I, really, I like our, I like, I like stroke. I think we should um, start yeah. uh, pitching it. Put it on note cards. Yeah. I'll, you get seven <laughs> note cards. You get seven note cards and make the bathroom break really <laughs> exciting. <laughs> and then you have cinema. Cinema. Uh, <laughs> We did Thank it. You. We figured it out. We did it, fam. We did it, Joe. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. Uh. <laughs>